Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. As you can see by the title, today is going to be another Disney related video, which is just so fun. I love making Disney related videos. So yeah, one of the main reasons I wanted to make this video was one, because I just love creating Disney content, and two, because in one of my most recent videos, it was a pack with me for Disney World, I basically laid out a lot of the clothes that I was going to be bringing to Disney and I got so many questions and comments asking where I bought it all. So I figured I would kind of just dedicate this video to showing where I get a lot of the clothes that I pack for Disney and just kind of showing some outfit inspiration if you are going to Disney and want to know kind of what to wear. I'm someone that loves planning out my outfits for Disney World like way ahead of time. Um, whenever I have a trip, I am like mostly so excited to plan out my outfits. It also probably is partly because I love taking photos in the park so I like mentally think what I'll be wearing in a park to take photos which may be super extra but that's just me. I'll try and list every article of clothing in the description below that way if you guys are curious as to where I got anything it'll be below. Some things may be out of style because like I reused a lot of things from years ago so I'll try and find a similar one if it's not for sale anymore. So with that being said, I hope that this video inspires you guys or at least gives you some helpful tips and tricks of what to bring. So yeah, I'm just gonna show you some of my favorite outfits I've either worn to Disney or ones I would be wearing if I was packing for a trip currently. So with that being said, I am just gonna jump on into this video and show you guys what I would be wearing to Disney World. Also, I'm going to be wearing these white bands with all of my outfits today just because they're super simple and white and go with everything. So these are what I'll be wearing today. Okay, I decided to start with this outfit because I wore this in my latest Disney vlog and so many of you guys asked me where I got it. So I figured I would just show you here. These are the pink ears from the Disney parks. I believe they are the millennial pink. And then this is a pink dress from Hollister, I believe in the size small. next outfit I have is this skirt but guys I sadly have no idea where I got this there's no tag on the inside and I honestly do not remember um, but it's just this like kind of red floral skirt and then I pair it with this Uniqlo shirt it's actually in a size US 11 and 12 so it's a kid shirt but I like the size of it I like what's a little bit on the like smaller side so and then I just love this little Mickey patch on the pocket and then I pair it with my classic ears just because the colors all go the best together I'll be showing you starts with these Hollister shorts. They're in a size double zero and they are ultra high-rise mom shorts So they're a little bit of like a baggier feel and then this is a vintage Mickey shirt I believe it was a Disney collaboration with American Eagle a few years ago So they might not still have this exact one, but I just love the color I love the pink and then these are the same ears I showed in the clips before also from Disney parks I believe in the color millennial pink is this Donald Duck crop sweatshirt that I've actually been wearing in this video. This is a size small and it is from H&M and I just love it. I feel like there's so much Mickey stuff but not much Donald Duck product. So I really love it and I also just love the color. And then I just paired it with these striped shorts from Forever 21 in the size small as well, I believe. Yes, small. I just feel like it goes so well together. Like it's kind of the same color as a stripe, so Super cute, also high-waisted, crop, so I feel like it fits at a pretty good length. So the next outfit is this red Disney sweater with this white tennis skirt and these ears. These ears are from Disney Parks, they're just the simple classic red and black ones. This white skirt is from Dick's Sporting Good and it is in the size extra small. 
And then so many of you guys asked where I got this in my pack with me for Disney video. So I got this just at Disney um, in like the Emporium and it's in a size extra small. this Star Wars shirt which I pair with these kind of loose beachy shorts I actually have no idea where I got these sadly um, but this shirt I got from five below actually and it's one of my favorite shirts of all time I just think that it's a super unique Star Wars shirt and I love the little stars and just the pink on it and I would definitely match it with pink ears just because I feel like it brings out the pink so I feel like you can wear this shirt with anything but I decided to do these shorts because one it's Florida it's always hot and it just kind of cinches in at the waist and is super cute together. This next look is more of a classic look. This skirt is super cute. It's from Ann Taylor in the size 00 petite. Um, but I love how it's red polka dots. It just feels super like Minnie Mouse to me. Um, and then this is just a white high neck bodycon suit in the size small from H&M. I would probably pair it with these ears just because again, kind of more of like a classic look. And then if it was chilly, I would add on this jean jacket. This is just like basic jean jacket and I actually sewed this patch on myself. So it's super fun to just thrift some jean jackets and sew on Disney patches instead of having to buy a Disney jean jacket because you're like triple the price and you can just kind of customize it more to what you want. So. That is this outfit. The next outfit for today are these striped shorts. They are from H&M and they are in the size US 2. They're just kind of a like looser, baggier feel. And this is a Disney Mickey Mouse shirt from Uniqlo. I don't know the size on this one, probably just like a small. And I just paired it together because I love the look of the navy blue stripes with kind of like this orangish green. I just thought the colors looked really cute together. So that is this outfit. Is this white linen dress from H&M. It's actually in the size US extra extra small and then I'm wearing it with these rose gold ears. These are just from the Disney parks. I'm going to be pairing it with this hair scarf. Not exactly sure where I got this but it's just like a basic hair scarf and then this is so fun. This is a small world purse. It's supposed to look like one of the balloons in the last scene of the attraction small world. It's like the same colors and it just has all the little kids on the inside so such a cute purse and i would pair it with something simple like this just because this doesn't have any big disney logo or anything so i love pairing more of a subtle disney with more of just like a simple look One I would wear probably in the colder months if I was going to Disney or fall just because this is a super fall color It is also like a high neck pretty thick sweater So probably won't be wearing this in the summer, but this is such a fun sweater It's actually from forever 21 and it just has a like very vintage Mickey. I love it It's a super big patch I would probably pair it with these vintage Mickey ears for that reason or a hair scarf depending on what look I'm going for and then I just pair it with some simple white jeans. These are from BDG and they're in the size 24. This romper from Abercrombie & Fitch it is in the size extra small. I love this romper just because it is so, so soft. And I also love the sleeves. They're kind of like princess balloon sleeves. And it just is like the most comfortable romper ever. 
And then I would probably pair it with these ears just because it's more of a simple color and these ears are really fun and bright. So I just think they kind of make the look a little bit more fun. Um, these, I'm not so sure they make them anymore. I think they might be an old edition ear. I actually have the tag on them. I got them for $7.99 on sale, um, but they are from Disney Park. So really not sure if they make them anymore, but if they do, I just think they're a super fun and cute ear. guys that is gonna be all for today i tried to keep it to around 10 outfits that way this video wasn't too long um i have so many more outfits i could have shown you guys and so many disney shirts i did not include but i might have to make like a part two if i really wanted to do more of this because this video would just be like an hour long it would be like 200 outfits as i mentioned earlier i'm gonna try and list everything in the description below i know a few of the items i got like years ago so i may not still sell them but i'll try and find just like similar items if i can't find the exact ones mostly i hope that this video was just an inspiration for you guys of either outfits to pack or wear at walt disney world i hope that you'll use some of them in the future or at least just take bits and parts of them and create your own with that being said i'm gonna end the video here thank you so much for watching as always and I will see you guys in my next video.